The night before the launch was quiet in a way that makes history uneasy. In conference rooms lit by fluorescent hum, engineers stared at charts and managers stared at the clock. Outside, Florida air cooled, frost forming where rockets were never meant to feel cold. And somewhere between caution and confidence, a decision was about to be sealed. The Space Shuttle Challenger stood ready on the pad, white against the dark sky, a promise of progress and pride. America watched with excitement. This mission carried not just astronauts, but a teacher, a symbol that space had become ordinary. Yet inside the system, nothing felt ordinary. Phone lines crackled as engineers raised a final concern. Rubber O-rings, small and unglamorous, might not seal properly in the cold. The warning wasn't shouted, it was reasoned. Calm. Technical. Charts were shared. Data was incomplete, but the risk felt real. The engineers urged delay. The temperature is too low, they said. We don't know what will happen. On the other end of the call, managers weighed something else. Schedules, public expectation, pressure that had built launch by launch. Delays were costly. Confidence was currency. The room grew tense. Questions were reframed. Doubt was softened. The burden of proof quietly shifted from is it safe to fly to can you prove it will fail. In that subtle turn, ethics met hierarchy. Engineers hesitated, knowing the limits of their data. Managers pressed forward, trusting experience, trusting momentum. The recommendation changed. Morning came clear and bright. Cameras rolled. The countdown reached zero. Challenger rose, fire and smoke, carving a path into the sky. Seventy-three seconds later, the promise shattered. What followed was shock, then silence. Then a nation asking how something so small could lead to something so final. Investigations peeled back layers of decision-making. Memos testimony, late-night calls. It became clear the disaster was not a single mistake, but a chain of assumptions, of normalized risk, of voices slowly quieted by process and pressure. The debate ignited and never truly ended. Was this a failure of engineering, or of management, of data, or of culture? The Challenger story endures because it isn't only about rockets. It's about how decisions are made when time is short and stakes are high. About whether caution is seen as weakness or courage about the moment when saying, wait, matters more than saying, go. If this story moved you, please like, share, and subscribe. Your support helps the channel grow and keeps these stories alive.